Oh, kalaka, 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 kalaka. Hey, it's Joe here. I'm back with another Guacamole Super Turbo Championship Edition Let's Play. And as you could tell from that wacky introduction, we are still on the lookout for Kalaka. We never actually got a chance to see him because we took a massive detour. And that was caused by a massive dragon. And then we saw the just about the biggest ripoff of the, the flame guy from Fantastic Four in this game called flame face and flame face is now the character that we're on the hunt for so we're kind of taking a detour from kalaka but if we look on the mini map we're heading sort of towards him i think i think we're heading towards no there's a question mark okay so it's not confirmed who we're actually going for now i think it's flame face and then we're going to be going for the other dude we're going to be going for kalaka then but I kind of think that versing flame face would be really cool. I hope that there's a really fun sort of section that we get to have a fight with him against, like a massive boss battle. Or oh, I was gonna say boss battle, but the big goat just appeared. So this is cool, and he wants us to complete some work. Oh yes, another power up. This is awesome. Okay, so we need to go to the trainatorium. And here's our next upgrade. Sweet. What did we get? Yeah. Why not smash the biggest object in the room? Okay. El Intenso. Yeah, I see it. That's the Intenso meter. Oh, okay. I see. So that's like a super energy, energy mode. That's cool. Okay. So we have to wait until that's full. Can we, can we just kill this guy? Can we kill him normally? Come on. Right. That's how the Intenso meter fires up. I see. You kill an enemy. And then, ooh, you go Super Juan mode. I kind of like that. That's a really cool feature. Okay. First, you fill your meter. Okay. Normally, you have to perform combos on your enemies to fill the bar. Okay. Once the meter's full and you're in a tight spot, Press both of the directional pad buttons, the left and right sticks, and release El Intenso. Okay, let's do it. Oh, that's good. I like how it stuns them and they get thrown back to the sides. That really adds in a cool feature. That's kind of a little bit like a boxing ring. You know how in boxing rings they throw them outside of the ring or they throw them to the other side of the ring inside the, the actual bars. That's pretty cool. I kind of like how they did that. Ties in with the whole luchador versus Juan theme. That's really cool. Okay, let's perform some combos and we will do this. Come on. X, X, A. Yes. Oh, can we get another combo? No, I died. Damn it. What? That, that's not very nice. Okay, let, let's try that again. There we go. And we'll get some combos done just so that we can keep this going. So we want to keep it going for as long as possible. Last time we didn't unfortunately have that option, so we're going to want to keep this going. Let's use Y, and there we go. Okay, still going, still going. Oh, yes, that's it. That added it up quite a bit, and hopefully he's the last guy. Is there any more that are going to spawn? No, and we've got 940 pesos. Okay. Well, that's going to be a really cool feature if we don't have any stamina left or we need to take out a whole bunch of enemies in one go. That's going to be really handy, guys. I think that's going to be an incredible help. So let's make our way down here. Get these barrels because, of course, oh, I was expecting pesos, but it's the Intenso bar. So that's also handy. It's cool how you can get that from barrels. That's really good. That's a good feature. Let's have a look here. We still need to get to the canal. But, while we're here, we may as well see what is around this area. I think we've been here before. Yeah, we've been here before, guys. I think we went there in one of the earlier episodes. Yeah, we did. All that area there, you see the parts that have been sort of mapped off, those more marked off, rather, the pink areas. Those sections are where we've been, and as you can see there, the faded part, like that, for example, is a section we haven't exactly explored from what I'm aware of. I think that's kind of how it goes and those little yellow dotted lines show the combinations of where we can travel to so that's a cool thing to keep track of every time that we're on the map menu 
So I think we're going in the right direction now. Unless a boss appears. I don't know. No bosses. But minions. That's a pain. Ooh. Come on. Whoa. I was waiting for them to come to me. I was just, just kind of lost in the moment there. Ooh. Talking of lost in the moment. That was pretty cool. That was pretty cool. That was like a full combo there. Let's throw this guy down. Boom. Okay, come on. Okay, they're spawning like crazy now. I need this intenso. Come on. I need to perform combos. Let's do this. <gasps> yes. Let's do this. I like the way how the guy just came on the screen. Like, woo. Use it now. Quickly. Come on. Ooh. Ah, can we perform it? Can we perform the moves? No. Okay, I thought we could perform the intenso move and take them all out with that shot. But hopefully this is the last guy and they don't spawn again. Otherwise, it's going to be quite catastrophic. But it should be... Should be fun taking this guy out. Boom. Oh, no. Oh, hell no. No, this isn't good. Whoa. <gasps> oh, okay. Right. I don't think I'm going to be waiting now. I was going to wait for him to, to just drop to the floor. Ah, there we go. So I am going to be waiting. Kind of caught that a bit too early. There we go. Oh, no, that's not good. Come on. At least if we take one out, it's going to be easier to take out the second. That's what I'm kind of waiting for. Come on. Yes, there we go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That was close. That was insanely close. Come on. Yes, he stopped now. We can hopefully take him out. One more shot. Ah, dang it. I think if we use three more stamina blocks, we're going to be able to take him out. It's just if he goes on the floor, it's a bit trickier, I find. I mean, I know it's supposed to be the prime time when you're supposed to hit him, but usually you miss the heart and you don't do as much damage from what it seems. But it's still okay. Still reasonably okay to try and get a hit on him. And there we go. Sweet. And another silver coin, which is awesome to find. So hopefully we can warp. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, that must be the power-up that I was looking at before where you can just warp at any given moment. But we're in the canal now, so that's good. We're at least on our way, as that sign points out. So I'm hoping that we find some really cool stuff here. That'd be awesome. Oh, okay. There it was. I was I was expecting for us to just use a stamina block and then make our way up. But here we go. Here's the canal. So hopefully we find the flame face guy here. And now we've got to find our way into the desert. So we've got to remove that roadblock that they were talking about in the last episode. So hopefully we can do that with some ease. That'll be pretty good. Let's make our way back down. And it's going to be a hell of a lot of enemies here. I have a feeling it's going to come. No, they're below us. Okay, that's not good. That's really not good. Whoa, okay. I'm going to just keep on dodging until these guys come along and make it just two times harder. Come on. Come on. Die, die, die. Oh. Oh, I was hoping that I could use one to attack one of the fish below. Come on. Oh, no. Oh, he's got a hook. He's got a really strong hook. And we took out one fish. That was very lucky. I was trying to hit this guy, but it didn't really work out. Oh, no. No, he did not. That wasn't very good. Okay, I'm going to go down there and give him a piece of my mind. I'm going to I'm gonna try and take him out. In fact, you know what, guys? I think I'm going to wrap up that episode there. I hope that you enjoyed watching. If you did, make sure to leave a like. I'm going to hopefully be taking out these piranha mutant type fish and the angry guys with hooks in the next episode as long as I manage to do it successfully. This is really actually quite tricky. But as I said, if you enjoyed, make sure to leave a like. And hopefully I'll see you in the next episode where I, I will hopefully be killing this guy. So thank you very much for watching and goodbye.